this was a race car loss where there looked like there was plenty of opportunity and you just were never really in the right place to take advantage of it. Yeah, we were always there very close to the opportunity, but we never quite had the, the pace and the the tools, to be honest, to get in the fight. You know, we, we have uh, certain weaknesses with the car that we know in this circuit are too big. And uh, whenever we were in a fight, it was very difficult to keep the others behind or, or, or attack them. No, So it's a shame because you could always see the podium there very close to you, but never really got the, the chance to, to fight for it. We saw that moment with Antonio. He said he needs to look at it again, so I don't think he was out of control really as he came out. No, he, he uh, I went to the outside out, out of turn four, turn five, and then I think he didn't see me and started steering left and I couldn't just disappear and uh, we ended up colliding. So a uh, bit of a shame for him, but uh, it's what it is and it's a uh, racing incident. Have you managed to get the confidence back in the car though after th that crash? Not crisis? really, not really. The only point where I was more or less confident was qualifying where the high rear grip of the soft tire was helping me to, to, get a, to understand the car a bit better. But unfortunately in race runs I just was sliding a lot the rear, never quite had the top speed and in the end, I was struggling with tire deck and yeah, very tricky to be honest. It's been a, a difficult weekend for me and um, yeah, now I need to analyze what I can do better and, and see if we can improve for, ne for next race.